Attorney Jonathan Elson, reminding you that if you've been injured in an auto accident, it's important to have somebody on your side. When you need a lawyer, then you need Nelson. You need Nelson. The Nye County Sheriff's Office has issued a declaration of arrest concerning the shooting death that occurred on Tuesday night here in Pahrump on Basin Avenue. Arrested is Moses Hoodie, who is 26 years old. According to the report from the Nye County Sheriff's Office, on February 21st at approximately 7.10 in the evening, Nye County Sheriff's Office dispatched received a call for a shots fired report in the area of the 2000 block of Basin Avenue here in Pahrump. Deputies responded and said that they could hear shots as they neared the area. They located a male identified as 41-year-old Shallon Bent. That individual stated that he and his father had been shot by the same suspect who was inside the home. That individual was transported by ground ambulance to Desert View Hospital with a gunshot wound to the leg. Shallon was interviewed at the hospital and said that the suspect later identified as Moses Hoodie had been suicidal and was holding a shotgun inside the residence. Shallon's 69-year-old father was found deceased inside the home. He was identified as Kenneth Bent. Shallon told police at the hospital that he and his father had tried to take the shotgun from Hoodie to prevent Hoodie from killing himself, at which time Hoodie opened fire on them, shooting Kenneth Bent, and Hoodie then dropped the shotgun and picked up an AR-style rifle and began shooting at Shallon, hitting the victim in the leg. Shallon said that he was able to get out of the residence and then crawl down the street while Hoodie continued to fire a gun inside the home. Police say at that time they arrived at the residence and Hoodie had a brief standoff with police until he surrendered to the Nye County Sheriff's Office SWAT team and detectives. He was then transported to the Nye County Sheriff's Office station. Police say that they interviewed Hoodie at that time and he stated that he knows both victims from the past. He had been in a fight with an individual, so he came to Pahrump to spend some time with the two individuals, who were father and son. Hoodie had been staying with the two at the residence since Saturday, February 18th, and intended to stay for about a week. He stated that both the individuals carried firearms with them in the house and had the firearms at the ready during his stay. Hoodie stated that he had been suicidal at the time of the shooting and had been holding a shotgun in his hand, pointed downward. The two victims approached Hoodie to stop him from killing himself, at which time he opened fire on them. Kenny Bent was immediately hit and went down. Hoodie then dropped the shotgun and picked up the AR-style rifle and began firing at Shallon Bent. Hoodie did not know that he had hit Shallon, but heard Shallon yell at him from outside the home that he had been shot. He said that he opened the door and looked outside for him, but did not see him, so he closed the door. He attempted to reload the rifle, but said he fumbled with the magazine and couldn't remember if he was able to reload it or not. At that time that he was taken into custody by police, they entered the home and located Kenny Bent in the location that was described by Shallon Bent and Hoodie. The firearms also that were described by both of the individuals were located at the scene. Moses Hoodie is still in custody of the Nye County Sheriff's Office being arrested on charges of open murder, attempted murder, and battery with use of a deadly weapon resulting in substantial bodily harm.